thank you for the for the follow-up the, the 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 issues are are escalating of suicides and and fights and brawls on board mental health deteriorating social media channels and news media channels are awash with horrendous stories about what's happening right now Sepras are many are into way beyond the 11 months I mean, and 11 months is the maximum allowed under the minimum conditions of the maritime labor convention there, there are seafarers many many of those 300,000 seafarers who are locked out at the moment are way beyond that 15 months 16 17 months and i have to say to you as a former seafarer whose repatriation who was delayed 24 hours it was a major crisis and drama this is a horrendous situation for the world seafarers did the uk's initiative make a difference i think it I think it did. I think it, it brought together some key governments and really helped to, to shine a light on that. And I think you have to put some credit on the UK initiative leading to the issue now being on the agenda of the United Nations. The Secretary General and his team have seized this issue and are pushing this issue through towards conferences that are taking place. Uh, later this month. So I think the, the UK has played a significant part in doing that. But the crisis continues uh, today and the majority of ship owners are, proved, are, are, are saying that it's getting worse.